Hey everybody, welcome back, and today we're going to be doing another lab. This is Energy Transfer and Temperature, Explore 1, and it's called Materials Matter, on page 121 of the Segment 2 workbook. So before we get started, I want to let you know that this video is not sponsored and no one is paying for it. For this lab, you will need three identical cups. 75 milliliters of water, 75 milliliters of cooking oil, 75 milliliters of corn syrup, a measuring cup, nine ice cubes, three thermometers, and a timer. So at the top of page 121, read the investigation and I also have that in the description below so you can read it before we get started. And the question is, will three different liquids lose heat at the same rate? Will three different liquids lose heat at the same rate? So go ahead and write your hypothesis in the space provided to answer the question. All right, and on the box in the bottom right corner of the page, our independent variable is time, our dependent variable is temperature, and our controls are the same thermometers, containers, the timer, and the same three ice cubes. And our variables are water, oil, and corn syrup. So go ahead and write that into the box. You can pause the video if you need more time. Okay, now we are on page 122, and it says, in the space below, plan out your investigation. So what we're gonna do for this lab is I'm going to have three different cups and one of them is going to be full of 75 milliliters of water. The other one is going to have 75 milliliters of cooking oil. And the other one is going to have 75 milliliters of corn syrup. So here are the three different cups. I have the cup full of water right here. I'm just going to place it over here. All right, there's our water cup. That's 75 milliliters of water. And here is our cup full of cooking oil. This is just some standard corn oil. So that's the second cup right here. And our third cup is corn syrup. And that is 75 milliliters as well. So there we go. We have our three cups, water, cooking oil, and corn syrup, all 75 milliliters. So now we're going to take three thermometers. There we go. And we're going to place them into the cups. And make sure your cups are the same so that this lab will work. So make sure all your cups are the same. All right, so now we're going to take a look at the temperatures for each cup. The water cup is 18 degrees Celsius. So write that into the workbook. The initial temperature for water is 18 degrees Celsius. The cup of oil is 19 degrees Celsius. And the cup of corn syrup is 19 degrees Celsius. So we have 18, 19, and 19. All right, now what we're gonna do is add three ice cubes into each cup. So we have a total of nine ice cubes. Make sure the ice cubes are the same size, three ice cubes. We're going to add them into each cup. And then we're going to start a stopwatch here. And every 60 seconds, we're going to take a look at the temperature again, and we're gonna see how much it decreased. All right, so I'm going to put the ice cubes in, and then I'm gonna start the timer immediately. All right, so there's our timer right there. All right, so the ice cubes, put them into the water, be careful. One, two, three. All right, start the timer. All right, there we go. So now we're going to wait 60 seconds and then we're going to look at the temperature again all the way until it reaches 360 seconds or six minutes. Five, Four, three, two, one. It's been one minute. Let's take a look at the temperature. The water is 10 degrees Celsius. The oil is 16 degrees Celsius. And the corn syrup is 17 degrees Celsius. All right, so those are the temperatures for 60 seconds. And now we're going to wait until two minutes. Five, four, three, two, one. And it is two minutes. Let's take a look at the temperature again. The water is 8 degrees Celsius. The oil is 13 degrees Celsius. 
and the corn syrup is 14 degrees Celsius. 14 degrees Celsius for the corn syrup. All right, those are your temperatures. Now we're going to wait until three minutes. Three, two, one. It's been three minutes, so let's take a look again. The water is seven degrees Celsius. The oil is 11 degrees Celsius. And the corn syrup is 13 degrees Celsius. All right, so write those into the workbook in the graph. And now we're going to wait until four minutes. Three, two, one. It's been four minutes. Let's take a look again. The water is seven degrees Celsius. The oil is nine degrees Celsius. And the corn syrup is 12 degrees Celsius. So those are the temperatures for 240 seconds. So now we're going to wait until 300 seconds or five minutes. Five, four, three, two, one. It's been five minutes, 300 seconds. So let's take a look. The water is six degrees Celsius. The oil is eight degrees Celsius. And the corn syrup is 11 degrees Celsius. All right, those are temperatures for five minutes. Now we're going to do it one more time at six minutes and then we'll be done. Three, two, one. All right, final temperature reading, six minutes. The water is six degrees Celsius. The oil is eight degrees Celsius. And the corn syrup is 10.5 degrees Celsius. All right, so that is the end. So we're going to stop the timer. So those are the temperature readings. I hope you got them all down. So the water, it went from 18 degrees to 6 degrees, the oil from 19 to 8, and the corn syrup from 19 to 10.5 degrees Celsius. All right. Now you're going to fill out the graph on page 122. And you, also your data table should be all filled out as well. Then answer the following questions on page 123. So this concludes this lab. I hope you enjoyed it. If you enjoyed this lab, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe for more science videos like this one. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in my next video. All right, microphone test, microphone test. Hi. All right, I think that's good. For this lab, you will need. For this lab, you will need. For this lab, you will need. Hey, you need this? Take four. Or three. I don't know. Okay, whatever. And then we're going to start a timer for 60 seconds. Or... And then we're going to start a stopwatch here.